Can I please get um, four Guinnesses? And I just want the Guinness perfect. It's my first ever Guinness. Oh, okay. <laughs> Here you go, Theo. If I'm going to start somewhere, it's got to be in Dublin. You know what? I've had a few sips here and there in London and I've not really enjoyed it. That is actually beautiful. Cheers, mate. What is he doing? This guy's on another planet. We're here in Ireland today for the Dublin Derby. Shamrock Rovers against Bohemians, two clubs separated by colour in this city that's mainly dominated by hurling and Gaelic football. You don't often hear about the Irish Football League and that is actually mainly because they don't get enough respect. There isn't enough money put into the league. It's on telly, I'm guessing, tonight. No, no it's not on at all. They're showing the rugby over. You yeah. I swear to God. So in this country, Irish football, is, it's not a big thing? No, well, yeah. it competes with the GA, the Premier League, all them sorts of things. It doesn't even have its own TV deal, one of the only top divisions in Europe not to have it, which is outrageous considering yeah. how if you even see the Irish national team they pull in 40 50 thousand every single week so there's a big interest for even with the Premier League over yeah. here you, you don't see it at all you know That's so astonishing the government don't back here Irish FA don't support as much as they could so me and my dad are here today show you what it means to the fans and let's see where it goes from here Shamrock Rovers against Bohemians let's give it a watch mate Another Guinness here. It's brilliant to be back in Ireland. Not been here 30 years. 7.3. Come on. We've had a bit of a mixed start this season. I think two one rovers. Two one rovers. I've got to say three one rovers. Three one. Confident. This is the final prediction for the Three one. Three one. Three one. Oh, Two nil. Two nil. What do you reckon? I'd say two nil as well. Two nil for the Rovers. Prediction? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Four nil. 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 Bohemians away end, section on that corner over there. The red pyros out on their side as well. Unreal, 
Dad, yeah, loving it. Come on, brother. We're about 20 minutes in. Good corner opportunity to Shamrock. So number four here is Shamrock Rovers, Lopez, the centre-back, played for Cape Verde in Africa Cup of Nations. And I watched him live, he's actually really good. Great, great turn. Shamrock playing really well here. Can they sneak a second before half-time? Great football. Brilliant. How has that not gone in? Shouts for the Bows. Oh, Half time. 1 0 to Shamrock Rovers. It was. There's only one team in this, and it's the Hoops. Yeah. It tastes like promotion! Yeah. Here comes the Bows. Nice little welcome to the, uh, the Bows goalkeeper here. Tackles flying in. Surely saved. He's missed it. Oh, How do you? Three more minutes left. Yeah. And it's all over. The three points are vital for the Rovers if they want to withstand another Irish League trophy. Let's see if they can do it. Oh. 
should be full time now. Here we go. Yesterday was absolutely brilliant. The funniest thing is, we flew out yesterday with expectations of, oh, it's gonna be a decent game, you know, there might be a few goals, a few slide tackles, but the reality was, there are fans with so much passion inside that ground that they will die for their badge. Bohemians and Shamrock Rovers, but even the rest of the league, you've got the likes of St. Pat's too, Owen Doyle, ex-Bolton big striker. There are fan bases in this league that need to be appreciated more. And I hope this video gets shared around Ireland because we need to get all the ground sold out and it needs to be respected by the people above because once these clubs start getting proper money they'll start to be looked at in Europe from a different perspective the Dublin Derby will be out there and they can climb in European competitions get more money in and just be more well known so I really hope if you watch this video you're from Ireland share it with your mates get it out there because that's what we need to do I saw potential last night it's a young fan base that club will never die as Shamrock Rovers fans sing it's potential for something major over the next few years. Irish football will grow. I'm so convinced of that. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe, but you can always get the link and put it in your group chats or whatever. And hopefully the league will start to get more respect. We're gonna go enjoy Dublin for a few days and then fly back to England. That's it for me. See you in a bit.